Summer is just around the corner, and that means families will be spending more time around the pool. K-Texas reporter Karina Hollingsworth has some ways to keep your little ones safe. According to the CDC, drowning is the second leading cause of death in kids ages one to four. A little known fact is that your child's swimsuit color isn't just a fashion statement, but it can also be the difference between life and death. Bright of the color, you should find them. You know, we have a lot of kids at the pool here. Uh, last week we had 267 kids at one time at the pool here, so it made it hard to distinguish all of them. My guards pay attention to people all the time, left and right, but at the same time, that bright color makes it easier to find them. Larry Hopple, the pool manager of the municipal pool in Sweetwater, says bright colors like fluorescent orange, yellow, and green are easier to see in the water. A study completed by Alive Solutions in 2020 shows how bright neon colors look underwater. And you can also see here how darker colors like blue and black blend in. And to the naysayers who say children can be seen underwater regardless of their swimsuit colors, Hopple says, think again. Because my pool is 12 foot deep. When you're down at the very, very bottom, you're just a blob down there. It's really hard to kind of distinguish if there's a person down there that is actually swimming or actually has gone comatose and now we need somebody to go down and get them. Hopple says the lifeguards on duty are trained to stay on the lookout. The pool manager says before the lifeguards go on duty, they must pass an evaluation in the 12 foot deep end, proving they can rescue a swimmer in less than a minute and 30 seconds. Hobble recalls a time when rescuing someone in the deep end wasn't just a test. Last year we had a, a guy who was a, a ninth grader here and he was struggling. You could tell it. He would, when, a, when a swimmer is drowning, they don't make any sound. They just look at you. They're like this, trying and that. And then you, my lifeguards are tuned to figure that out. And he quickly went in, you know, looked at me, I said, go get him. And he went and got him. The kid was very grateful. He said, man, I really appreciate you taking care of me. Hopple says drowning can occur in as little as 30 seconds. And the best way to protect your kids is to be alert at all times. In Sweetwater, I'm Karina Hollingsworth, K-Texas News.